One cup of sugar, one fourth cup of lemon juice, and one fourth cup of water. Hey guys, I'm Brianna. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe. I'm going ahead and starting off this maintenance video by making the wax that I use to do my underarms and also my Brazilian, but we'll just cover the underarms in this video. So I'll link the channel that I follow for this recipe down below. She has been a lifesaver. I saved so money, so much money from doing this at home by myself. And I do have to go into the salon to start the Brazilian, but once I've got it down, then I just maintain at home. So what I am showing you guys today is how I wax my underarms. So as you guys can see, it is time. And this is how the wax looks once I am finished making it. And this is just a soft wax, so I'm able to pull it off with wax strips instead of making it a hard wax where you just put it on and then you can just take it off with the wax itself. What I love about this is it's all natural and it's just you know it's only wax sugar and lemon juice so i will like touch it on my lips just to make sure that it is not too hot and that's how i test it so when you see me put it up against my lips that's what i was doing just testing the temperature so um i do eat it because it's just sugar <laughs> but um this gets easier and easier the more that i do it you guys i love waxing at home in this video i hadn't waxed in a while so i was just kind of nervous but honestly when i stay on a schedule every four to five weeks it's super easy it doesn't hurt at all and the hair isn't as thick so this is what this strip looks like and i just go over it once more just to clean it up and i just love doing this wax sugar wax at home you guys it's super easy it gets all of the hair it's free wax lemon juice and water is very very affordable it's cheap so you know that versus paying 50 dollars, i'd rather do this like i said i will leave the channel that i follow down below and she shows you step by step in so many different videos in so many different ways on how to get the perfect wax but if you guys want me to do a detailed video on how i do my brazilian at home definitely leave that down below because i feel like i have some really good tips that i can tell you guys how i pull it off and what direction and just how to do it the best way and even how i have started making my wax i kind of have like a method to it and um i just love it i love it so comment down below and let me know if you wax at home and my friend actually saved my name in her phone as g like i'm a thug i'm a g for doing this myself but like i said i'm saving money and i love it this is just so therapeutic and after you're finished i definitely feel like that girl so we're gonna go ahead and get into washing our hair next so wash day you guys i used to dread wash day but now i really love it i only wash my hair when i am feeling up to it when i feel like i'm in the mood this day i felt really good and this was a great wash day of course i'm using olaplex and i'm not going to put the full wash day in this video because it is very detailed and long but i'll link the full video up in the cards if you guys want to go check that out and watch watch it and i'm showing you guys my wash day from beginning to end how i get the perfect silk press using also all olaplex's products <laughs> i'm tongue twisted today but yes guys i really enjoyed this and in this clip i'm using the um olaplex number no. 4c which is the clarifying shampoo i had some buildup in my hair and i just made sure to get that out so next we're gonna go ahead and shave our face so i got these razors from tj maxx and I just went ahead and used my soap from Good Molecules and I absolutely love this soap. I have seen the 
improvement in my skin as I've been using this. So I'm just going in and shaving my face. Now, the truth is, you guys, I did not used to shave my face. When I turned 27, kind of 28, somewhere in between there, I noticed that when I was doing my makeup, I had a little mustache and you can see it through the freaking makeup. Are you kidding me? So of course, I went right ahead and shaved this face, honey. And also I have been noticing like a hair under my chin i am just flabbergasted when you get older as you age you definitely change so this has become a part of my maintenance routine and i'm not mad at it my makeup goes on much much smoother and i just love this whole process so i just clean up around my brows definitely get that mustache girl and just get um like a little bit of my sideburns i like my sideburns so i leave them there but i do shave them up and shape them a little bit and yeah this is just like a cleanup routine that i really love i really grown to love and like i said the makeup application is super flawless after this and this is all the hair that came off and then i'm just going to use some of my sunscreen to add just so that I can be protected once I go outside and am exposed to the UV rays. I love black girl sunscreen and it just adds a really nice glow after um, shaving your face. So that's another reason why I love this. So next we're going to go ahead and get into the nails, the press-ons. I've been obsessed. So the number one key to making my press-ons last long is just to put a light one light layer of glue all around the nails make sure you're hitting all the areas all the crevices and then after that you go in with one good drop oh just that one drop y'all is definitely a science to this and then you just push the nail on push it back into your cuticle hold it there for 10 to 20 seconds and the nail is on it's not budging my nails last two to three weeks and i just absolutely love them i believe i got these nails from shein but i also get some french nails from shein that i absolutely love i also get my nails from kiss from cvs walgreens you know so i'm just i'm a press on girl like the nails are so easy so convenient and imagine doing this once a month and your nails lasting two to three weeks or you know it lasts it could last four weeks but usually on the third week i want to switch it up so i absolutely love these press-ons guys and this is the formula to getting great great long lasting nails and also you just want to buff your nails also before you put your nails on and also push your cuticles back so that the nail could fit right in there really snug so these are how the nails look and next i'm just gonna go ahead and go in and shave and file and shape the nails and this is how they turned out so thank you guys so much for joining me for maintenance day if you like this video give it a big thumbs up and comment down below and let me know if you would like to see the brazilian wax video i love you guys so much remember do what you love and love what you do and i'll see you guys next time bye